Here's the interface, and it is really awesome. Now our website is published, let's view it. It is working completely fine, and our ad banner is also showing. After downloading open and install it, here the game is working properly. I am going to create the most popular game without even writing a single line of code. You can sell these games on Fiverr. This person on Fiverr is charging $500 for this type of game. Let's compare his and my game. You can also publish it on the website and can even create an app. Amazing thing is that everything I'll told or I'll do is completely free. If you want to play it, the link to the game that we are going to create is given in the description. We are going to create the most popular game Flappy Bird, which got 90 million downloads in one day, but was removed. So let's start. First of all, open chat GPT. No, no. I'm not using GPT-4. I am using the free version of chat GPT. Okay, okay. Oh. Thank you. Here is the prompt. Build a popular game Flappy Bird using HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. Chat GPT has given three different codes, HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. We need to test this code. Open the codepen.io website and sign up to get started. Here are three different boxes to put codes. Copy and paste each code in its box. Now the game is displayed on the output. We can play it by pressing a single button. It's very difficult and almost impossible to play. Let's ask ChatGPT to make it easier. Now ChatGPT has given the updated JavaScript. Here's the updated Java code. Open CodePen and paste the JavaScript. Now the game is OK to play. But the motion of the bird per click is very high. Ask ChatGPT to decrease the motion of the bird per click. ChatGPT has updated the JavaScript. So replace the updated JavaScript with the old one. Now it's able to play for the normal users. We need some additional features like scoreboard and a game over pop-up with a retry button. Ask ChatGPT for these implementations. Don't worry the link to all the prompts is given in the description. Now ChatGPT has given the complete updated code. Now replace this updated code. Now you can see that a simple scoreboard is added and also a game over pop-up shows when the user outs. The game is ready, we need to upgrade its graphics, and we have to add a background, a bird image, and pipes. Simply ask ChatGPT to upgrade the graphics, and it will give you the instructions. Here are the ChatGPT instructions, basically, we need to upload four different images, background, bird, pipe for the top part, and pipe for the bottom part. Open Google and search for the PNG images, we need images with no background. Real PNGs would have a white background and when you open them it turns into this. Now search for a background image and download it. Now search for flappy bird pipe. Here's the straight pipe, download it, scroll down and you will find the upside down pipe, download it also. Now we have four different images, we can't directly upload these images to ChatGPT, we need web links. For that, open the post image website and sign up to get started. Here upload all four images. Go to ChatGPT and add the title, click on the share button and copy this direct link and paste it into ChatGPT. Do the same for all the images. Here's the code with all the links of images inserted. Open the code pen and refresh it. Now fill these empty boxes with the new code. Here's the interface, and it is really awesome. You can even upgrade it by using your creativity and efforts of ChatGPT. Let's publish it and we'll also create an Android app. Let's ask ChatGPT how to save and run the code. First of all, create a folder for the game. Then, open the notepad, copy the HTML code, and paste it. Click on Save, 
For file name open ChatGPT, ChatGPT has provided the names for all code files, paste that file name, and save the file in the game folder that we created before. Close the notepad and open a new one, do the same process, according to the instructions provided by ChatGPT. Here our complete code is ready, open the index file to run the game. Before publishing we need to put ads in our game so we could earn money through that game. We need an ad code like that, you can get this through AdSense or AdsTerra. Then ask ChatGPT to put the ad code on the game over the pop-up. ChatGPT has updated the HTML code. Replace the code. Now you can see that the ad banner is showing. When the game overs the ad also pops up, more impressions and clicks on the ad means more earnings. Now, edit the index file and replace the code. Now let's publish it. Open the tiny host website and sign up to get started. Here we need to upload the game. Go to the game folder and make a zip file of the folder. After that, upload that zip folder. Choose a name for your website and publish it. Now our website is published, let's view it. It is working completely fine, and our ad banner is also showing. Now let's create an app for phone users, for this open web into app, and sign up to get started. Here put the link to your website. Give a name to your app. Enter your brand name. Set an icon and click on Make an App. Select the category of your app and write a description. Here's your app dashboard. And here's your app page to download it. Let's try it on the phone. Open the app page and download the APK file. After downloading open and install it. Here the game is working properly. Try it now, the link is given in the description.